Welcome back. I'm Candace Conroy, IABB Bikini Pro and two-time Olympian here at Muscle Contest 2024 Ultimate Warrior Competition. And this is our winner for the Men's Classic Physique 2024 overall title, Christopher Barnett. Hi, Chris. Congratulations. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure to be here. I just wanted to first uh, first uh, thank everybody who supported me, my girlfriend here, my two posing coaches, um, Josiah Rivera and Case Butt from the UK. I'd also like to thank my prep coach, the Terrence Ruffin, um, multi-time Olympian and Arnold Classic winner. He's the one that backed me on this and supported me through my prep as well, um, as well as my family, my father, my mother, and so on and so forth. I could, would not be here without them, so thank you everybody for supporting me along the way. Wonderful, Chris. Well, I just wanted to say I thoroughly enjoyed watching you up on stage and judging you not only does he have an amazing physique he just exuded this grace on stage with his beautiful posing routine and it wasn't just a posing routine at finals in pre-judging when you did your quarter turns when you did your individuals it was like everything check the boxes for me and you just know exactly how to develop your physique on stage to show off everything beautifully um, how did you learn all that was it through just your own eyes was it through a posing coach yeah so I learned through multiple avenues. When I first got into posing, I was uh, I was actually a teenager and I was just Googling YouTube videos of Bob Paris, Lee Labrada, even Terrence Ruffin himself, watching and studying their posing routines. And that's what originally got me into bodybuilding. Later on, when I uh, grew to love the art, I also wanted to compete. And so that's when I linked up with my coach, Terrence Ruffin. Since then, I've uh, collaborated and worked with multiple posing coaches, such as Jacob Pomroyk, uh, Grassfed Fitness on, on Instagram, and Daniel Coffin, among other great ones as well. I've studied from them. I've learned from them. I have coached multiple IFBB pros as well as NPC competitors on my own end as I'm a posing coach now myself. It all came together. I love the sport and I love the art of bodybuilding. That's wonderful, Chris, to hear. So what was the biggest challenge for you this prep? The biggest challenge uh, for me during this prep, it would probably be, um, well, if I'm being perfectly honest, hunger. <laughs> hunger. Hunger. That, that's a, that's a pretty hunger. solid one, yeah. Yeah, so there were multiple times where I was like, oh, I should cheat on my diet. Oh, I want this. Oh, I want this. Oh, maybe I'm not lean enough. It's very much a mental game, whether it's like you're psychologically hungry, maybe not physiologically hungry, but psychologically hungry, or even just getting into your own head. You have to, whatever you do, stick to the plan, trust in the people that are backing you in your corner, right? And when you link yourself with those like-minded individuals, those who are more knowledgeable than you, and they keep pushing you, you gotta trust in the process. It's so crucial. Trust in the process. You can want to give up, just don't give up. You can wanna quit, just don't quit. Stick it through to the end, and you'll get first place. Absolutely, I love that. And who this is, this lovely lady is? My girlfriend Ariana. I'm really proud of him. He's pushed so much. He's fucking amazing. <laughs> well, what was your biggest challenge for this prep? Because it, it it takes a team. It literally takes a village to do this. You have your support system, your friends, your family, your posing coaches, everybody. So, what was your biggest challenge in getting him to this place today and winning? Um, I would say like hunger. He was really hungry, so he'd get super moody. So was it like hangry? Yeah. yeah. I like back away. <laughs> but you did amazing. I love that. But it was all worth it in the end because every everything turned out beautifully. Well, congratulations, you guys, and that's it. We'll see you back here later.